Hey there, job seekers. Fed up with all the mixed messages about unions? Feeling like you're swimming in a sea of conflicting info and just want the real deal? Well, get ready because we're about to break down unionized and non-unionized work in plain, simple terms. No beating around the bush, just straight up honesty. What is a union? First, we have to understand what the concept of union is. So basically, a union is an organized group of employees who collaborate and communicate with their employer to negotiate the terms of their employment. In a union, employees can negotiate aspects such as wages, benefits, hours, and other working conditions. Union employees can achieve this through collective bargaining, which is the act of negotiating the terms of employment as a group through means of a binding contract. The purpose of a union is to act as an intermediary between the employees and the employers. Essentially, unions give employees power through togetherness. What is a non-union? On the other hand, a non-union workplace recognizes employees as individuals. Employees in a non-union negotiate the terms of their employment through individual contracts. In a non-union job, the employers hold most of the power, which means that they develop their own guidelines and work expectations, including hours, wages, and work schedules. Unionized Strength Imagine yourself backed by a team of colleagues, wielding the collective power of negotiation. That's the essence of a union. They champion not just for better pay rates, but also for guaranteed daily overtime pay meaning you don't have to wait until hitting 40 hours before earning extra for those long shifts. And the best part? Your union-negotiated health insurance is often fully covered, meaning more money in your pocket and less stress about health care costs. Feeling stuck in a dead-end position? Many unions invest in your growth by offering on-the-job training and advancement opportunities, all while you get paid, not just learn for free. And let's not forget the perk of predictable work hours, allowing you to maintain a healthy work-life balance. With a union, you're not just working, you're earning, learning, and building a secure future alongside your colleagues. Navigating the non-union landscape. For those craving flexibility and direct negotiation power, the non-union path beckons. You get to keep more of your paycheck, and negotiating directly with your employer might lead to faster adjustments in pay or work arrangements. However, remember that power in numbers adage. Without a union, you stand alone when it comes to negotiating for better pay, benefits, or job security. This vulnerability can leave you susceptible to unfair treatment or unexpected dismissal. Training and development opportunities might also be limited, potentially hindering your career growth. And the allure of a flexible schedule can come at the cost of unpredictable work hours, impacting your personal life. Choose your path. Well, to be honest, there is no one-size-fits-all answer to the question of whether to join a union. The best option for you will depend on your individual circumstances and priorities. However, there are some general factors you can consider when making your decision. Industry. In some industries, such as construction or transportation, unions are more prevalent and offer significant advantages to workers. In other industries, such as tech or startups, non-union environments are more common. Priorities. What matters most to you in a job? Job security, high pay, flexibility, or specific benefits? Once you know what your priorities are, you can start to research which type of workplace is more likely to meet your needs. Research. Don't rely solely on online resources. Talk to employees in both unionized and non-unionized settings to get their perspectives on the pros and cons of each type of workplace. Ultimately, the best choice is the one that empowers you. This video provides a starting point, but the journey to career satisfaction requires thorough research, careful consideration of your priorities, and open communication with individuals navigating similar paths. Remember, you deserve a work environment that aligns with your aspirations, and with informed decision-making, you'll find the perfect fit. If you enjoyed the video, please don't forget to hit the like button, subscribe, and ring the bell.